the OECD sets out a framework and its principles based on the concept, and I'm quoting here, that we should reinforce what, what it calls the open and accessible nature of the internet. And I think those are absolutely critical terms to remember as we, as we have this discussion, open and accessible. And I believe that these principles move us close uh, as Rebecca McKinnon's new book, which is out this uh, month, for those of you who haven't seen it, it's called Consent of the Network. Uh, as, as her book puts it, uh, it moves us close to understanding that we do not have to choose between anarchy in cyberspace and laws that will effectively ruin what we've built to date. That's a false choice. Anybody remember that phrase? Um, combined with other OECD guidelines on corporate social responsibility, uh, some things that I would really point you to because the work the OECD has done in that area is extraordinary. These principles, at the very least, provide the balance that we should be seeking. They incorporate the best of other efforts to date, uh, whether you're talking about other international efforts, whether you're talking about the White House principles that the Obama administration put out, whether you're talking about principles that uh, a group of companies, uh, including Citi and GE and Google and others put out under the National Foreign Trade Council about the free flow of information and economy. All of those kinds of principles, the OECD incorporates the ideas, incorporates them concisely and well. And, God hopes, those principles obviate the need for any new sets of principles 